Miss Bradley, today we got a special treat. She's gonna share her secret. Now, we do all kinds of wild game cooking, but you gotta have dessert. That's and what's right. the perfect dessert for wild game? Fried apple pies. Fried apple pies. This is top secret. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody has ever tried to reproduce this before, and here we go. You gonna show us, you're not leaving anything out? No. This is the whole real deal. Edith, show us what we're doing This is from here. the start. You gotta have your dried apples. Dried apples? Yes. Okay. Dried apples. Now, how do you dry your apples? Or do you buy them? I buy them already dried. So you can buy these. Where, where do you get something like that? Well, these come from New York. New York? Out of the plant before they dry them. Okay. So you gotta start with some dried apples. There we go. Yeah. Then you cook these the day before. You put water on them and cook them till they're tender. And you add sugar and a lot of cinnamon and thicken them with a little cornstarch. So just to taste. You know, some people like, yeah. might like them sweeter. Some people That's okay. right. Then you put them in the refrigerator overnight. Okay. Really? So that kind of brings the, brings the water back out in them, swells them back up? Well, they'll swell up when you're cooking it. That dry will make a big pan full. Okay. So that's just just about enough right there, okay? Yeah. And then next morning you get up and you make your pie crust. I make it just like making biscuit dough. If you ever made biscuits, you know what that is. <laughs> and you take that. You must be a professional. Have you done this before? No. You got everything ready right here. It's almost like you've done this before. Take your little flare on your board. So just like you're making biscuits. Yeah. Work it up a little bit. And you want to roll it real thin. Push a fire out. Yeah, so it won't get sticky. So the trick is getting it thin, huh? Yeah, you want it thin. Now for those who don't know, who maybe they haven't made biscuits, how do you make your how do you make your dough there? I make it with safe rice and flour and shorty and milk. All right. Then you take your saucer, you lay it down, you take your knife. And you look like you've done this before. A few times. <laughs> Ask the people of the First Church of God. <laughs> now, if they're just tuning in again, tell them how you did this part. You got your dried apples and you did what? Yeah, I cooked them with put water on them and cook them till they get tender. Then I sweeten them and put cinnamon in them. And, uh, Sugar and, and cinnamon. And them up with cornstarch. Okay. And put your dried apples in there. Okay. This is going to be, to turn out too good. Okay, get you, ooh, that's already looking good. Fold it over and take your fork and crimp it and seal it up. Okay. That's fancy smancy there. And there's one. So just a regular little saucer, that's yeah. the perfect size to make you make you circle. Keep it from sticking. Mm -hmm. Stick your fork in that fire once in a while and keep them sticking. Okay. Now they're ready to put in the skillet and fry. How about that? Then you put them in your hot oil and fry them. Mm -mm -mm. So you just leave them in there until they get a good golden brown? Yeah, I can turn them. Fry them on one side and then turn them over on the other. Wow. Now, what kind of grease are you using there? L-A-R-D. Lard. <laughs> there you go. And all, all the people that I know growing, growing up with that use lard, it's the not healthy stuff. They're the ones that live to be 100 years old. Uh, I use lard all the time, and me or my husband, either one, don't have no high cholesterol or nothing. Don't have See, no cholesterol medicine or nothing. That's um, all I ever cook with. Fry my chicken, and everybody goes crazy over the chicken. It's cooked in lard. It's good stuff. 
see? Mm -hmm. Turn it around. Oh, that looks good. I'm going to go home and buy me a big bucket of lard. <laughs> I'm serious. I buy the 25 pound bucket over to save a lot. No. I'll tell you where to get it. All right. <laughs> Now, eat a little bit of ice cream would be good with that, too, now, wouldn't it? Yeah. They're better hot. Better hot? Put them in the microwave and heat them because you dip the ice cream on top of them. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, Edith, I have a tough job. I have to hunt and fish and occasionally have to eat good food. Isn't it terrible? Yes, it I is. I have a rough life, don't I? Yeah. Well, I'm going to try one of these. Okay, it'll be good for you. Mmm. 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 <laughs> Eat us fried apple pies. You can't beat them. you got to try them. Thank you so much. Thank you.